It's still Margot Gear from Arizona in lane four. Hines and Romano flanking her. It's gonna be Gear in the 100. She gets the double. As a swimmer, I've been able to gain a lot of different character traits that I'm gonna be able to transfer over into the real world. I think the commitment to a high standard is something that I'm really gonna take with me moving on. There's been so many times as a student athlete that I've referred back to the, th the three words that Coach Damont talks about every day at practice. And those three words are attitude, effort, and intent. And I'll continue to use these three things as I move on. Thank you, Woman of the Year is something that I heard about when I got to campus and something I, I saw uh, a few other swimmers, it was an award that I saw a few other swimmers receive. And so I think in the back of my mind, I've, I've, I've thought about this award, but it was, it's really been about the process and just enjoying the journey that I've had these past four years. To be mentioned along with all these names is, is pretty incredible. These are people that I've aspired to be like since I stepped foot on campus. And so to be mentioned in the same sentence as them is just very special to me. I think being a candidate for this award is a true reflection of the hard work that I've put in over five years. And not only myself, but I think the entire athletic department, the, it shows what I've done with the opportunities I've been given. Since I've been an Arizona Wildcat, I've loved to give back every single season. And one of the groups I've worked with is Ben's Bells. So we've gone in and we've created some arts and crafts that um, help spread kindness throughout the Tucson community. And this community service is something that I really cherished throughout my four years and I think it reminds me that um, as a student athlete we can give back and we can make a difference. I think Arizona is extremely special for a few different reasons. I think the campus is such an attraction. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a wonderful environment to be in every single day. I think the leadership that Greg Byrne and our coaches provide on a daily basis is second to none. And I think the teammates that you surround yourself with every single day um, really bring you up higher on a daily One, basis. Two, three, three. 22 years old, can she do it? Can what? she get an American record? She would love to get that back-to-back -back Hunter freestyle. Gear is looking good in lane four for Arizona. And the white cap. Here looking very smooth right now, just in complete control. Margo Gear, the senior for the Wildcats. She wins the 100 free. Margo Gear defends her championship. My favorite moment as a Wildcat is probably being able to get on the national championship board and win three NCAA national championships for my team. And besides that, just the every single day being a part of something extremely special. What's next is I'll be moving forward and training here at the U of A to compete in the Olympics uh, in Rio in 2016. And then from there, I'd like to become a swim coach one day. Bear down.